It's a weather action day. I'm meteorologist Stacy Donaldson. We'll see rain changing over to snow here for the metro area as we go through the rest of tonight. Once that temperature drops, especially as we pass 9 o'clock, we'll see that snowfall throughout the overnight hours. So after 9 o'clock, past midnight, we'll see some heavy snow starting to show up here for the front range. Thursday, heavy snow pretty much all day long. Friday morning, we start to see clearing skies as this storm moves out. But in the meantime, dangerous travel expected here in many places across the front range. Extreme travel troubles here off to the west and to the southwest of Denver. Major issues here to the south along the I-25 corridor all the way down toward Colorado Springs. Minor and moderate here the farther east you go across the plains and into northeastern Colorado. So we are under a winter storm warning starting at 9 o'clock tonight here in Denver. Winter weather advisories up toward Greeley and south toward Pueblo. And we're going to be seeing some very heavy snow showing up out toward Estes Park, Red Feather Lakes, and even into Evergreen. We could see two to three feet of snow there, one to two feet possible here for our area and parts south. So as I said, we're going to see some travel trouble spots especially into tomorrow. At this point, we've seen some rain change over to snow kind of periodically here to the south as uh, the temperature fluctuates. So once that temperature really takes a nosedive, we'll see this change over to all snowfall here for our area and parts east. We already have the snow coming down in the higher elevations and down to our southwest past Canyon City out toward Buena Vista. Farther to the south, rainfall near Trinidad and Colorado City with a mix of rain and snow, also snow out across the western slope, and we'll see more of that as well. So this is that rain snow line right through the metro area as we get toward almost nine o'clock. Once we get past nine o'clock, we see some heavy waves of snow push, pushing across the front range and across eastern Colorado. And this will last all day tomorrow. Temperatures in the 30s by tomorrow morning. Really not a huge fluctuation in our temperatures. We'll be in the low 30s as we get into the afternoon with that heavy snow. And that snow will continue as we go through our day. And especially in the morning tomorrow, you'll be dealing with that snowfall early on. So allow extra time to get to where you're going into the afternoon and evening. We still have snow here changing over to some rain for northeastern Colorado as we head into the evening and then that snow still going at 11 o'clock tomorrow night. As for our snowfall forecast, we're looking at very substantial amounts of snowfall here for the front range. One to two, possibly even three feet of snow to our west into the higher elevations. And this is what it looks like statewide. About three to ten here up toward Greeley and Fort Collins. Twelve to twenty-four here near Denver. Eight to twenty-two to the south. And about four to eight from Eagle to Aspen with winter weather advisories in effect. So highs tomorrow in the thirties here. Forties farther to the east and southeast. And as we get into Friday, we still have some legs snow here in the early morning hours on Friday, then we'll start to see some clearing later in the day on our super seven day forecast. We'll be in the low 30s for tomorrow, 40 degrees on Friday with a chance for snow in the morning, then clearing later in the day and a great looking weekend in store temperatures in the upper 40s, low 50s, and then those 60s return on our super seven day forecast for Tuesday and Wednesday, low to mid 60s for afternoon highs with more sunshine on the way.